Hey, this is Steve Caballero, and today's episode of Pro Tech Technique, we're here at Pood Skate Park, and we're going to be doing the Frontside Smith Ground. First, initially invented by Mike Smith with the Smith Stop, where he would do a frontside pivot, hit his front uh, rail on the coping, and then come in. And I think it was Alan Losey that actually took it a little bit farther and started grinding it really far, um, which led into the, the Smith grind. Basically on a front Smith, you, you want to be able to know how to do a front side grind properly. I like to learn on something small first and then take it to something higher. Um, but you got to really make sure that you can actually lock your rail in and that it's steep enough your rail is or your side of your board is grinding and hitting the coping. When you're approaching that uh, at speed, um, you want to go really fast and as soon as you get up on the grind, you want to immediately uh, put your front rail down and push down on your toes and kind of leaning back and just kind of gliding around the coping. And as soon as you feel like you're going to lose your speed, then you lift off your weight and put your weight on your heels and then kind of guide yourself back in. You know, it's, it's something that you want to work your way up to, you know, start with Smith stops. And then once you have a Smith stop um, wire where you go up and you pivot on your back truck, hit the rail, come in. Um, you can go up it with a little bit of speed and then you just start going a little bit faster where you can kind of maybe grind one block and then come in and go a little faster, grind two blocks and then just give it your all and just do a gnarly one. Smith grinds can be done on mini ramps with, with, with you, got, you have a straight wall and it can be done in bowls where you got a curved. Uh, for myself, I like I prefer a curved bowl because it seems to lock in and it seems like to be able to go longer versus doing one on a ramp where you have to really push and kind of just kind of go sideways. It's nothing to lock you in, but when you're in a bowl, it seems to like lock you in and you're kind of going, going around in a circle. Um, so for myself to do a longer Smith grind, I would rather do it in a bowl. It's, it's all about weight distribution. And so when you're first going up with a wall, you have your weight centered on your feet. And then as you go up into the Smith grind, you want to put all your weight on your toes. And while you're grinding, you're, you're, all your weight's on your toes. And when you're about ready to come in, you shift all your weight to your heels to, to bring it in. So you come out of the lock and roll down the wall. So weight distribution is really important when you're doing Smith grind. Thank you guys for watching ProTech Technique and uh, comment below and just let us know what you want to see next.